should care about climate change because it affects every aspect of the world that we live in. Climate change, according to science, is making the world a place that suffers more extreme weather events, so we're getting more storms in more places. We're getting greater droughts at the same time in more places. It's going to affect a lot of those things that we don't necessarily associate with climate change. And so it's going to have an impact on practically every person that lives on the planet. And with 9 billion people on the planet by 2050, all competing for resources, we need a better plan how to distribute those resources and how to make the things that we all depend on. People want to understand what they can do compared to, you know, building a new coal-fired power station in China. They, you know, taking the bus as opposed to taking the train or flying doesn't seem to be making much difference. But actually, all these actions do add up and they do make a difference. And we've seen remarkable changes in Europe in the last number of years, partly because of laws, but partly because of greater awareness. We've seen emissions in lots of countries come down at the same time as people who continue to enjoy good lifestyles. So, it's possible to do it, it's possible to do it relatively painlessly, and it does make a difference. It's called COP21, which is the 21st conference of the parties to the UN Framework Convention on Climate Change. It's taking place in Paris from the end of November to the middle of December and it will feature representatives from 196 countries, including many of their leaders. The Paris negotiation hopes to secure two things. One is a new deal on climate change that will limit emissions of carbon dioxide that scientists say are really driving temperature rises around the planet. The other thing it aims to do is to change the nature of how we do business on this planet, which is how we produce, how we farm, how we make things and how we consume. This is a long-term goal. It's about changing the very nature of progress. If they manage to do that, that'll be one of the most significant things we've ever achieved.